Good morning, everyone. It is a lovely morning at Thompson Pass, and we're gonna get ready to go riding here. The back side is a little more zigzaggy to get down, but it goes. Oh, yeah, dude. Why do you like that sled? It's really easy to ride. It's way easier than Greg Stafford's old sled. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sounds crazy if you got like the faster you hit stuff, the more stable you are, you That's know, when you get into it. So. Yeah. I mean, over there, I went off track. You guys probably noticed. Oh, yeah. It's that like was a complete accident. I was like, gotta keep going. Yep, no, it doesn't matter. You just like stay fast and like get back on it, you know? <laughs> About to drop down onto Missouri Glacier down there up in Thompson Pass. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's kind of a super highway that goes out both different directions. But we're gonna go way back in there for some sled laps. Hopefully, the weather doesn't move in. been moving in so I think we're probably gonna start motoring out or at least I am these guys might be skiing something else up in here but uh, I think I'm gonna take advantage of this sunshine and start heading back while I can see where to go so stoked to be out here love it <laughs> Thank you. 
made it back nice and safe and the weather is changing so i figured it'd be good to rush back anyway we got some smash burgers going right now on the grill get stoked about them whole key to it is just having that flat cast iron inside the grill. Gives it a nice grilled smoke taste, but then uh, it's hard to explain. Just go try it. Look at that beautiful smash burger. Mm-hmm. Hey, is that in Lighthouse truck? Yes. Hey, the Casa Broca? We have to shoot things. I got a little bit of time. Got your leg, your leg. We're very important. Hey, no time to say hello, goodbye. Hey, no time to say hello, goodbye. Thank you, Dustin, for all the work you put this on, man. Mark, you started it off. Bringing the folks down. Yeah, let's give a round of applause for those uh, bringing this all together. And, uh, such a beautiful voice. Have you guys ever tried to find a way to poke down? No, Maybe it's I've impossible. seen this route before, but it's, you can see it gets real fucked yeah, up down there. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, we've, tried, we've tried a lot of ways to get yeah. back in here to not do that creek route. Yeah. So if you guys don't snowmobile or snow machine or snowboard or any of that stuff, this is called a uh, ghost riding. So I basically drive myself up the mountain and then uh, push my snow machine off the edge. Just like that. <laughs> and then we go ride. Ugh. <sighs> 
Another beautiful bluebird day, and we're going up and over the mountains right over there. That's cool riding up that thing. Yeah. Been out that way in a while. Here, Jeremiah, we're dropping down. We cut across into the books and now uh, we're dropping down towards the road. We're gonna try to ditch bang all the way back to the tailgate parking lot. But got a couple tricky spots to get, to get around.
have a ditch? There's a ditch. We're just gonna break up onto it. Then, uh, yeah, just start going. We'll pretty much stay on the left side the whole time. Should be able to break up right here. It'll be all right. Oh, yeah. So right now we're down at 19 mile and we came from 29 mile, which is the tailgate parking lot. Um, and we did this huge, pretty much tour of the glaciers. Yeah, dude, nice and smooth, come on up. Anyway, we're gonna try to ride from 19 mile all the way back to the tailgate parking lot, 10 miles up the road. So 10 miles of ditch banging, probably some culverts to get around, stuff like that. It's gonna be fun. Looks like it's going to be a little bit on the flat light side of things today.
There you have it guys, another epic tailgate Alaska in the making. Awesome time hanging out with friends, meeting some new folks, and just getting out riding. So if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you on the next one. Peace y'all.